Over the past few months, these tricycles have become a familiar sight around certain Lagos neighbourhoods. Known as We Cyclers, they go door to door collecting plastic and aluminium rubbish, with households earning points that they can turn into gifts. Local Bilikis Adebiye had the idea of setting up We Cyclers while studying in the USA at the Institute of Technology in Massachusetts. The recycling is not common, there's very low awareness on recycling. People don't even know what recycling is. So we used the incentives as a way to kind of get the conversation started, let them get excited about recycling because of what they're going to get from it. But then as they're recycling and then they see the other benefits from the cleanliness, from the uh, reduction in flooding, reduction in diseases, people will now see why they should continue to recycle. Lagos, a megacity with a population of around 20 million, generates 10,000 tonnes of waste a day. Empty plastic sachets of cheap drinking water, which are very popular in Nigeria, are often found strewn across the city's pavements. We cyclers bring these to companies like Bridgeco Global, which transform them into small plastic balls before selling them onto factories that produce objects like basins and buckets. We cyclers have been collecting recyclable waste from Suru Lere for a year. Before it's very dirty, smelling everywhere is so dirty. But since I'm with them, everything is clean. So they normally come with their gift and whatever. That is how I find them that they are good. In 18 months, We Cyclers has collected 200 tons of rubbish from over 5,000 households. The company aims to expand from 31 employees to 100 and cover two more densely populated neighborhoods by the end of 2014.